All right, so really heavy damage on top and bot. So mid is still open to be hard utility. And jungle is still open to be hard carry. Nocturne banned. Will Kha'Zix be banned? That's what I want to know. Because I look at Ken and top here and I think about a Kha'Zix angle. Okay, so Wukong I do think is broken, but this would be so boring. Yes, it's the Kha'Zix! Yes, finally, man. Thank f Now go Galio. No? Why not? Why wouldn't you go Galio here? No. <gasps> Fiddle? Wait, but you wouldn't do it blind. You wouldn't do Fiddle blind. Boring. You also don't have a lockdown element with this, but I guess Gragas can technically do it all himself. He can mass displace enemy team and then just E burst them with his uh with lockdown anyway. Either way, just displacing them like that is more than enough to set up isolation for Kha'Zix. So I do like this combo. It's a bit more boring. On Fiddlesticks, we were talking about Fiddlesticks as a potential counter pick into low mobility mages. Which is why I wouldn't necessarily... I don't know. You can do it into Annie. Um, and you just E-poke them off cooldown whenever Comet, Mana Flow, Band are up in lane. Uh, and the range that you have on that versus any mage is insane. Uh, later on, you can literally just fear them and ult on top of them in lane. He's got the crash going. It's basically impossible to clear against Kenan with E start. Okay, and now this bot to top is turning into diagonal jungle into a straight dive. Winning mid, winning top. Yep, you should anticipate doing something like this. They go for it, they get the kill. But it's onto the jungler, not onto the top laner. So this doesn't hard secure Broken Blades matchup to the same extent. It does help though. So he is more powerful than Kha'Zix right now until Kha'Zix resets. The question is, can Viego get anything before Kha'Zix resets and comes off the map? Is there anything to get on this wave? Yeah, the top side and Viego is top side as well. He went top side for Krugs, Broken Blade. Flashes over to try to deny Viego. Viego's here. He has a long sword over the Kha'Zix. Even if Kha'Zix gets this kill, I think he just dies to the Viego straight up. And that's going to be huge. Viego will actually be in a really good position. Okay, Viego's actually in a really good position off of this. Okay, Viego needs to recall. I need to see the amount of available gold on Viego here. Cap's bot side. They have full knowledge of where enemy jungler is. So they can make a hard play here. Cap's basically every single wave crash which is what you want to be doing every time you have a crash you want to think what can i get off this when you know you're going to end up with a crash in the future you want to look two waves into the future and be like where's the map going to be like that okay how can i play that state out right can at least limit the amount of hp caps has at least distracting him here would help your top laner a lot, but she lost a full wave on mid for that. Now she loses her life. Now it's just not worth. Went way too close for that one. Like, that was way too hard to disrupt. You want to try to disrupt as Gragas is trying to crash the wave. Obviously, there are way less angles on that than with a normal... Oh, we're just farming Woody. Um, than with a normal mid lane matchup because Gragas is so safe in his crashes of the wave, right? By the time he wants to crash, you have a very small window in which to trade with him. I mean, pivot off of mid control into just a straight dive top where they actually kill the Malphite. Thank God. I mean, this game is in the bag. This game is fully in the bag. Not in the same, not in the same way that like the BLG game was in the bag for BLG when they were just soloing bot lane and then lost anyway. 
Um, their control this game is like too far. Oh my god, Hans Sammer has absolutely zero mercy on these randoms. Wacko! Nice trade by Wacko there. Nice trade by Wacko. Nice cleanse. Oh, he's out. He's out, by the way. He's out. They fucking... No way. Wait, 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 wait. I'm... That. I'm reversing on that. It looks away for like two seconds. Wait, Yike just opened up on Junjia like this? Oh, okay, he actually kills him, but then he jumps on Woody without like recognizing where Yubao could be. Holy shit, man. Oh! It doesn't even matter! It doesn't even matter because BSG are so bad. They just convey about one after the other after the other, man. Oh, shit. Okay, on you, Bell. Oh, there's so much damage coming out of Han Sammer here, man. There's so much damage. No way. Wait, they were all so low. Wait, they were all so low. How does this go so bad? Show me the replay. Oh, my God. They can't even do the Baron. They can't do the Baron. Oh, they can barely do the Baron. Wait, Caps is here. Surprise, motherfuckers! <laughs> oh, it's continuing! Oh my days. Oh, it's happening again! <laughs> oh my god, there's gonna 50 50. It. Wait, why is Yike? Why is Yike so far on the other end of the pit? Oh my god, man. Oh my god, they just leashed it for them. Oh my god, man. Why did Yike go so far through into the pit? That's why I was saying this might be an R Evolve game, motherfucker. They can one shot you. Oh man. Uh, Michael X has been caught. Broken Blade's gone in! He's actually got both the carries in there. They're all solo. Oh my god, man, the stop- Oh! Caps, okay. The fucking stopwatch is hard cucked, yike, though. Okay, but the carries are fucking down, no? They're just chasing down Junjia. That should be- Wow. Really, that W didn't hit? Alright. Oh... He has a nice stopwatch, but you're fucking dead for sure. Are these fights going so badly? Wacko gets just destroyed straight. Okay, I don't get to see what happens with hands. They're going very hard for this soul. And they will be there first. Yike won't, but everyone else will. <gasps> or if they hold for Junjia, it gets quite bad. Any spell books? Nope. Oh, Michael X! Okay, the displacement from Kennen and Michael X is very anti synergetic. Holy shit, man. I hate Malphite so much. <gasps> Yike! No! He doesn't get it, man! Okay, you have to win the fight. You have to win the fight. Okay, thank God. Oh my god, man. This is a Black Cleaver and Eclipse that Malphite's invincible. Holy shit. Okay. 
now we go Baron. There's 40 seconds before you have to worry about anything. Surely this Baron is fine. Oh, man. You always have an exit strategy if you push mid into a play, right? That's the that's part of the reason why mid push is so good. You always have the exit strategy. See here, he's not fully convinced by the fight. <gasps> Yike got the soul! Oh, it's huge! Oh my god, look how zoomy he is. Oh, the isolation comes out! It's huge, buddy! Yikes resurrecting. Oh my god, so many resurrections happening. Rako's not dead yet. I mean, Junji is fucking 100% dead. Okay, Wako is against Caps. Caps is too tonky. Oh, Yikes in! Yike gets one! Reset gets two! Reset! On to the third! Let's fucking go. My god, this guy takes a while to die. For the love of God, why won't he just fucking die? Nice. Fuck me, man. Meanwhile, <laughs> thousands of miles away. <laughs> we weren't worried. We always knew they'd win. We, we always knew they'd win. We were never worried, guys. You think it's impressive now? Fuck, man. You should see me trying. I would pick Vayne, by the way. I'm just saying. I would insta-lock Vayne here faster than anything you could possibly fathom. But he goes Olaf because he's not that Giga Shad. I'm sorry, but they have Cassante, Vi, Leona. How is this not a Vayne game? Wait, this is an insane Vayne game, by the way. What the fuck? Yeah, people just forgot Cho'Gath existed, for sure. But like here, I'm thinking Cho'Gath can actually help control an Aphilios fairly easily, right? And I think he has a very good lane here. Well, not a very good lane, but he has a much better lane than most other tanks you could do. I love this level 1 from Broken Blade. I think if you have a strong level 1, you should try to disrupt jungle as much as possible. We've talked about this on previous streams. Um, fuck, but he actually got a kill off that. My god, man. Yeah, he proc Conqueror basically solo against Azzy before Vi even tried to turn. Vi level 1, though, this is the thing. Like, you're looking for champions that you beat level 1. Vi is fucking useless level 1. Vi has one of the worst level 1s in the game. Yeah, they're just abusing pre free Vi, that fucking flash by Yike! Oh, the flash by Yike! Dude, they're just abusing the fact that Vi is completely useless until level 3, man. They're just abusing it. So game resumes and they 4v2 dive bot. Hands picks up one. He wants it. He's trying to splash damage the tower to prevent the recall. Caps actually looks for it. He's splash damaging the minions to try to get in. Now he's on minigun. Okay, gets one. Doesn't go for the second. Okay. They do. And Yubao does die. Nice. Wacko picks up a kill on Yike. I mean, Woody can. Nah, he's actually just dead. That was really good by Wacko. That was very well played by Wacko. He's on green. Yeah, he's done it. He's done it. He's done it. He's done it. Ah. Uh, flashing onto melee on hands there was really fucking good by him. It's on the lane to make a play towards hand salmon. That's what you do. So, by the way, I mean drop it for hand salmon or drop it for Yike. Okay, they make a play anyway onto Yubao, who's just absolutely sprinting the series. Lean heavy bot. Jinx needs to be able to fix her wave, guys, so please keep going. That's enough information for Jinx to fix her wave, I think. I mean, I'm fine with this. Dive Broken Blade, I don't give a shit. That's why he has Tiamat. He could just insta-give the wave under tower and try to trade one for one. 
Get all these plates on hands, baby. Yes, that's my fucking cocaine right there, man. That's my fucking cocaine right there. God bless. God bless. Oh, 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 he's going for it. He gets one. Oh, don't know about that flash at the end there, but I'm glad he got one. Oh, hands gets kill as well. This is fucking perfect. Let's roll, baby. Let's roll. What is that? Oh. What was that? Did you guys see that glitch? Holy shit. Okay, win expectancy. All right. I couldn't see. Is the win expectancy in our favor? Has to be, no? All right. Hands just reset off of the held. Moving in. Oh, Junji are down. Doesn't translate into a reset on Hans Sammer. Oh, win expectancy 100%, by the way, no? Win expectancy 100%, no? Because oh, he's just going to go and get polymorphed and get fucked. Oh. He has blue, but no R. He needs to, like, green Q to make any use of the blue. I, I think he missed, no? Yeah, okay, it's just over. It's just over. It's just lost. This, this, this is a Jinx composition, okay? This is the shit. This is what I wanted to see from all three of the fucking BLG GG games, fraudulent regions, LCS, LPL, suck my gigantic fucking testicles, all right? This is how you play Jinx, all right? This is how you play Jinx comps. It's so fucking easy. You don't have your Lissandra all the way over in Africa while your Jinx is chilling in France, right? Like, you, you have them all together at the same time and fucking kabooms, alright? Like, come on, man. Okay! Broken Blade goes straight onto the- Oh, no wipes here for Philios. He's fucking dead, actually. Boom, boom. Oh, I like... Okay, Vi is actually cancelling Hans Sammer's AAs in, but all the damage has been done already. All Hans really need was the fucking rocket. And now they're just chasing on two different fronts. Broken Blade flashes the take notes. That is an incredibly toxic emote. I don't know. I swear Riot emotify a lot of the things that they would ban me for spamming in chat. I'm just saying. I'm, I'm fairly sure Riot just sell me the ability to be toxic while removing my ability to be toxic for free. Alright? Am I, I'm, I'm kind of correct here, no? Like, there are some very toxic emotes you can buy. But if I was to say those things, ban. This is GG, and then I'll... Come on, this is GG. Alright, it's fine. It's fine. Just double back for the Drake. Who cares? When the enemy in... Oh, wait, 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 wait. This could be the fight. Azzy needs to kidnap Han Sam. <gasps> he finds him, actually! But he gets... No, he still kidnaps him into the team! He killed Han Sammer! Han Sammer is dead! Okay, yikes got one reset. Needs to get another. Oh, it's over, it's over. We end the game on this. We end the game, we end the game, we end the game, we end the game, we end the game. Two resets, bitch. <laughs> Wacko is on the most useless gun setup I've ever seen in my fucking life. What the fuck? What are we doing here? Yeah, go for it, man. Oh, now he's on. Oh, okay. I mean, this is more useful, but... Oh, wait. Wait, holy shit, dude. This guy's positioning is so fucking good, actually. Dude, that guy's positioning is so good. Oh my god. Wait, what? This guy is so good. Wait, this guy is so good. Wait, that guy's positioning is so good there. Holy shit. And the game is over. <laughs> But it looked really cool for a couple of seconds there, alright? It did look quite cool 
for like a small bit, you know? Like that looks a bit cool. Alright? Alright. It was that was cool, you know? But <laughs> Alright, they absolutely fisted them.